intended in terms of sales and just the crowd and those sort of things? you 
found yourself being incredibly busy, uh, just trying to keep up with the the giant backlash, or not backlash, the um, influx, the influx of, of interest since the show. Um, how have you been uh, managing with that? Have have your friends come on board and are helping you out with things like to prepare for conventions and that oh, sort of thing? Well, ever since the Kickstarter happened, I, I am currently still fulfilling all my Kickstarter stuff. Okay. Kickstarters always last forever, um, <laughs> and it's always going to be in the back of your head for the rest of your life. But um, yeah, I've just had like an influx of people interested in getting artwork for me, interested in seeing more of you know work that I put out there. Like if I suggest an idea, there's always people who are like super behind it and they want to, they want me to do it, and it motivates me to do it. Okay. And um, has have you been able to use uh, this this newfound fame that you've gotten to kind of promote other artists like within oh, yeah. your circle and and raise them up with you? I mean, any time that I can promote another strip searcher, I will obviously do so. Um, but a lot of my friends who you know want need help with sales or like need help with online awareness, I always tip them out and add my word to their credentials <laughs> that counts for anything. Okay, that's awesome. Um, is there that you wanted to uh, mention that you're working on or might be released in the near future? Uh, if you would recommend them attending SPX as maybe a friend.